guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I have some new hair going on here. What do you think? What do you think? Do blondes really have more fun? We'll see. <laughs> um, but I've always wanted an ombre for like the past like six years. Like ever since ombre, sombre, like balayage was a huge thing. I've always wanted it, but I don't have the best luck when it comes to hair salons. They always seem to like make my hair orange or too dark or whatever. So I'm always too afraid to actually like go get an ombre. So this is a synthetic wig from Everyday Wigs and I love it. What do you think? I don't know. I could never really commit to doing this to my hair, but a wig is like so much fun just to throw on and like go. I can't stop staring at myself, sorry. Also, if you have like damaged hair, like I have really, really damaged hair, but you guys already know that I'm like a huge fan of extensions. Like I love tape-ins, I've had sew-ins, I've had clip-ins, I've had almost every single hair extension that you could think of, I've tried. And so I'm like no virgin to like having hair like that's not mine on my head. And I just, this is my first time with a wig and I love it, like I love this. I love that I can just take it out and throw it on and don't have to do anything to my hair. And also if you have like, if you're a person that has damaged hair, you don't always want to be putting heat to your hair and styling it and this gives your hair such a break like I love it and also it looks natural to me like I it looks like it's growing out of my head and I've styled it in like a little waterfall ponytail half up half down type of thing and it looks super natural I mean in my opinion at least like I said I'm a little wig virgin so if you guys I don't know you guys let me know what you think but this is a synthetic wig it is 22 inches, so it comes down to right about my hip area. Um, it's super, super thick. It is synthetic though, so that means that you can't put high heat tools on this hair. Like you can do a heat styling, but it has to be on the lowest heat setting um, possible. And honestly, like you really don't need to do much with it. Since it is synthetic, you can kind of just like work your fingers through it and kind of put it where you want to put it. Um, I've also tried like pin curling it at night like before I go to bed like I'll put it on and then I'll roll my fingers like this and pin curl it and then when I go to wear it I have beautiful curls I'm freaking obsessed this is my first time putting on a wig and I'm not gonna lie it's a little difficult also because I have taping extensions right now my hair is I have a lot more hair than I normally would so it's harder for it to lay flat but I freaking love this like for real yes um so what came in the box let me show you the box it's from a brand called Everyday Wigs, and look at the box, it's so gorgeous. I got this in the mail and I was like, okay. Like I love floral, so this was beautiful. You get a little like wig brush, like this, and it almost looks like a, one of those like wet brushes, like the bristles are plasticky, and it just helps to like get the tangles out of the hair, because with synthetic hair, it can get a little tangled. It also comes with a wig cap, which I'm wearing right now, um, and I'll show you guys here in a second, but. And then this is a lace front wig, so. It comes with lace, I say this, it comes with lace like this at the part, so it would be like right here. And you just trim it off and it looks like the hair is growing out of your head. One thing I recommend is if you do wanna get like an ombre wig or like a crazy color, anything like that, I recommend that you get roots on your wig that match your hair color, just cause it's easier to blend that way. Um, I have my wig set back right about here and I left a part of my hair out like maybe this much on the sides just so that when I pulled it backwards it looks like it's coming out of my head um, I'll show you guys that in a second but yeah overall review is I really like this hair I really like this wig I would totally be into like trying more I'm not the kind of person that's gonna wear like a pink wig or like a blue wig or purple wig that's just not my style but they do have some really cute ones on there um, but yeah I love this I love it I feel so cute <laughs> so as you can see I have my wig cap on right now this is how I part my hair just because I knew that I was gonna be styling it half up half down um, so I just kind of parted my hair and left the perimeter out and this is so that when you put the hair the wig on and then you go to put it up you have your hair to cover the wig and so I just put the wig cap on this came with the wig and I'm putting it right there to where right to where the wig will lie and this is about as flat as I can get my hair um, I do have tape and extensions in right now so it makes it 
a little bit more difficult but so this is what the wig looks like itself it's 22 inches long it comes with some like waves already in there as you can see the root is the same color as my hair um, and then on the inside you have the lace front which I've already cut off and then you have two clips at the side and then one clip kind of in the middle right here also there are these straps at the back that kind of close like a bra which you can adjust to make it smaller or larger for your head whichever head size you have so how I put this on is I hold the wig like a bucket like this so it's open to me like this and then I kind of put my head into it Alright, so now the wig is on, just how I would do it. I lined up the part of the wig with the part of my hair right here. And now I'm going to reach under and secure the wig just by sliding those clips that you saw right into the wig cap. And your wig is pretty secure and then you can go ahead and style it however you want to. As you saw in the beginning, I like to wear it half up and that's why I left some of my hair out. So I will just kind of start to like play with it push my hair back and find wherever I want the half up do to start however big I want it and then I can just clip however I want to alright guys so I hope you enjoyed this review once again the wig is from everyday wigs I will leave everything you need to know in the description bar down below I hope you guys are all having an amazing day an amazing week and I'll talk to you soon